who or what was responsible for bringing the plague to Galveston. Humans normally contract the bubonic plague when they are bitten by fleas infected with the bacteria. But the thing about fleas is that they need a host. What do many coastal and port cities have plenty of? Rats. The disease is carried by rats and spread by fleas. So I'm sure most of you have been bitten by fleas one time or another, and you probably noticed they go around your ankles. And so the flea itself regurgitates or defecates, what a lovely description, <laughs> into the little wound, the little puncture wound that it makes in your ankle. And that's how um, you become sick. The bacteria spreads into your lymph system. So you'll have huge swellings on your neck or your groin and they were what are called buboes. I actually thought, where does the word bubo come from? It's actually Greek for groin. Mm. And so these swellings are synonymous with bubonic plague. Black death comes from, so you have hemorrhage in these lymph nodes and they bleed. Essentially, you will develop gangrene. Now, Galveston is a port city. There are ships from around the world arriving at the port of Galveston every single day. So the idea is that an infected rat ran down the mooring lines of a vessel at the port and the infected rat's fleas began infecting other rats here on the island, officially beginning the outbreak of the bubonic plague before any human cases were detected.